Hey, welcome back to part six. It's not actually back to part six because this is the first time you're watching part six. Welcome back to the series, I guess. Yeah, that's it. Anyway, I hope you're enjoying it as much as I do. I say it always, but it has been a wild ride. I think it's almost closing down, but yeah, let's get on with the video. Nope. Time to break out your Russian bell. Well, she's... <laughs> you know what this dude thinks about Park. She's a true professional. I don't trust anyone at first, but after Berlin, I realize she's the real deal. Park's one of the guys to me. <laughs> one of the guys, my ass. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yep. It's a long way to Moscow. I didn't mean to press that. I had to ask more questions. Stand up again. You gonna keep making me stand up? Sadly, I do. You're kinda fat. <laughs> Hell no. KGB headquarters? Just between you and me. And me? And Sims. I hope I never get closer than pulling up in a car and picking you up. This has every chance of going tits down. Up, man. Tits up. Up, down. What's the difference? Don't ask me. I don't know. Ask Sims. Bell. What's on your mind? This isn't the first government agency I've broken into. The best are virtually impenetrable. But there's always a weakness. In this case, the weakness is the KGB placing too much trust in one of their own. If there was ever an operation suited to your skill set, it's this one. I handle the talking, you get us the names. Why do you ask? I don't know, sir. I'm kind of self depreciating by nature. Mm hmm. I don't. He's not one of mine. If I couldn't put my life in the hands of fetid strangers, I'd be in a different line of work. No, MI6 focuses mainly on the perimeter. Agents in client states, smaller figures within the USSR. They go from the outside in. Belikov is one of ours, supposedly. I'm trusting Hudson here. Man could be a pain in the ass, but he's no fool. Scar? You mean this? Is it noticeable? <laughs> I jumped off a roof in Calcutta back in 75 while chasing Ooh, a Soviet agent. India. The jump was successful. The landing, not so much. Advice? Always make sure you know where the utility poles are. Okay. Okay. Gotta fuck hearts on up. Have you come to convince me that you should be headlining this operation? No. Oh, is that right? Well, at least you're not hiding behind Adler. I'll grant you that. Now what is it? That's on a need-to-know basis. And from where I'm standing, there's no reason in hell you need to know that. You're to make contact with him and follow Adler's lead. Negative. Digging into the KGB's most classified database would blow his cover and burn years of posturing. He'll get you in, but he won't go near that list of names. We can't take the time to fabricate them. Belikov will get you uniforms, and from there you'll need to improvise. Strategically speaking, this board is on insanity, which is precisely the type of work we rely on Adler for. <laughs> Either as Adler's most trusted ally, or as cannon fodder. An excellent proposition. Why do you want to punch you the more you talk? Where's girl? Girl! Girl! There's no girl. Exciting bell, let's go. The Lubyanka building, KGB headquarters in Moscow. 
The sleeper agent records are stored in the archives 100 feet below ground in a nuclear defense command bunker. Your only way in or out is through this high security elevator. We'll need proper credentials. That's where our asset, Belikov, comes into play. Belikov has been our source inside the KGB for nearly a decade. He'll get us in. He came through for us in Yamantown. He'll do it again. This shit is crazy, even by his standards. You sure he's on board? An immediate nuclear threat warrants every risk at this point. I'm sure he wouldn't disagree. Sims, get Belikov on the line. Алло, Беликов на трубке. Извините, я думал, что это писал с Сингапура. We're almost to the tunnels. Do you get access to the bunker? There's always a problem. Solve it. Oh, I think we have to... <laughs> We're getting the files in that bunker. Do whatever it takes. We'll meet you at the basement entrance once you have the bunker key. Kamra Belikov, you've been summoned to the conference room upstairs. Secretary Gorbachev is here from the Central Committee. Oh no. Just have to come back tomorrow. Hey, Vasily, did the general come through here? And this is as far as I can take it away. Have you ever been to Poland? Comrade Belikov, have a seat. General Secretary Brezhnev has taken an interest in the new security development. There's a mole within the KGB. The committee wants someone from the first chief directorate to oversee Colonel Kravchenko's investigation. If you've not met him already, this is Imran Zakayev. Thank you, Secretary Gorbachev. And thank you all for welcoming me with open arms. I can think of no greater tragedy than a home violated from the inside. The trust and love within a family is sacred. Apparently. Not everyone shares your beautiful sentiments. Comrade Belikov. As head of security, I understand head you of practically security is more awesome. yourself trying to unearth this mole. How is that gone? <laughs> I am not a patient man, Belikov. Or a compassionate one. Until the mole is found, I want security increased around the bunker. Zakayev, do you have any recommendations? We should restrict bunker access. We also want to cultivate closer relationships with all of you. <coughs> I want to know your hopes, your fears, your ambitions. Be thorough, but we don't want any significant disruptions. And you, you Belikov? Who do you think should retain bunker access during the investigation? <clears throat> Why does Zakai look like Hamza Timayev from UFC? What the hell? It pains me to say it, but in a troubled time like this, even generals need restrictions. <laughs> Secretary Gorbachev. Only General Charkov should retain his bunker key for now. <clears throat> Very well. See to it. Worry yourself no longer, sir. I've already ordered the bunker keys collected from the men. Comrade Belikov, we are in grave danger from the capitalists. Our collective, our very way of life is at risk. The traitor will be caught. And he will pay a high price for his betrayal. 
Belikov, you are dismissed. For some reason, I know that they know. <clears throat> I'm being watched. I need a bunker key. Now, first, I'll have to kill the cameras. Have you ever been to Poland? Sir. This area is restricted. If I'm spotted Sir. here, I'll what can I do for you? Now I need to hide the body. How about one of those lockers? I have to get a bunker key for Adler. He'll need it to access the vault. Unfortunately, Cherkov now has the only one. It's humbling to see this place from the inside. Mirikov, have you dug up my mole? No matter. We've discovered additional unauthorized communications. Within hours, we will know the exact computer they came from. Comrade. Fuck. I will be exposed soon. In the server room, I could point evidence towards Cherkov. What can I do for you? I'm sorry, Comrade Belikov, but Zakhaev has increased security measures. You'll need authorization from the war room like anyone else. Good day, sir. The guard won't let me in. I need to get what he asked for. Or I can take him out. Should I take him out though? How do I take him out? Sir, what can I do for you? No, 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 we are playing it safe. We'll explore all the options before. Pretty sure there's multiple options to kill, I guess. I think we'll go with something easy. What can I do for you, Comrade Belikov? The general will be questioning a prisoner today, but should be available most of the time. <laughs> Just let me know when you're ready to meet with him. I have a chance to kill Cherkov. Kravchenko's office will have the poison I need.
How can I help you, sir? <coughs> Comrade Belikov, we have a dissident inside, Pyotr Ivanov. Charkov wishes to speak to him. Yes, comrade. I've already secured the room, but please, go ahead. I understand he's been collaborating with our enemies. He'll be sent away for good soon. Oh, no. Whoever you are, you won't get shit out of me. Help. You need okay, my there's a certain help. pattern of doing Save it. Your you breath. Know, Ivanov won't cooperate. Yet. I should find leverage in the records room. In you go. Good night. KGB has his wife and daughter's abductions already planned. That's good. I can use this to my advantage. my family have to do with any of this? <clears throat> yes, anything. Please, what do I need to do? Kill him. Uh, I'll try. But swear to this, my own life for my family. <clears throat> I think that's done. I'm not sure though. Belikov, 
I've just heard the most amusing thing. Aww. Let's okay. chat once I'm finished here. Okay. Comrade, how's our friend doing? I don't know, sir. He doesn't have much to say. No. We'll see about that. Citizen Ivanov, I trust you're enjoying your accommodations. Go to hell. Be advised, we have a situation in the holding cell. What do I do? What do I do? Yes, sir. Okay, now I need to head to the basement and let Adler's team in. You're really not going to say anything? How can I help you, sir? Ladin. Anytime. Team will need uniforms to get best security. Luring two soldiers into the tunnel should do the trick. Bielikov here. Send a security detail to meet me in the furnace room. Immediately. Wasn't sure you'd come through. I don't have much choice, do I? This key card gives you elevator access to the bunker. What about uniforms? Shh, sounds like they're here now. Okay, I will lead them through and distract them. You two do the rest. Down. Take cover. Keep it clean. Uniforms are no good to us, bloody. Там, там, там. Я нашел мне запертую дверь. Нету никакого оправдания этой некомпетентности. У нас есть очень строгие протоколы, чтобы это предотвратить, понятно? Окей, okay, I have to leave, but you should have everything you need. Now, if stopped, you are reporting to Commander Sobol. Get changed. and key card are in the bag. Niet. Okay, I should stop saying a random Russian words. Once we're in the bunker, we're on our own. Do we look Russian though? I'm black. I'm sure I haven't seen a black Russian. Is he wearing sunglasses in the KGB headquarters? No metal detectors for us. We're going around. Куда это вы направляетесь? Досмотр обязателен для всех без исключения. 
Вы должны пройти досмотр. Товарищ, доставьте вашу сумку сюда для досмотра. Поэтому я не могу носить. Дайте нам пройти. Не принимайте это близко к сердцу, товарищ. У меня приказ досматривать всех, без исключения. О, oh, гадно. <laughs> товарищ, ты нужен за Кайву. Я разберусь. Спасибо, товарищ. Внимание, повреждение города готовы. Позовите, Беликов. По-моему, я здесь, нет? Пойдем. Будет продолжаться столько, сколько нужно. Я ждал Ольгу Соколову. вы прибыли ах да разумеется то ваш командир я не расслышал сорта рейд сорта something so bold yes i remember yes твое сопединение я как раз к нему на прием Обязательно передам ему привет от вас. Прежде чем Гравченко успел с... Оружие на землю! Это закрыт на зону! О, Горд Рейкоэн! Oh, 
We're almost to the vault. the list bell. Copy it to a disc.
Get a mask on Belikov. I'll cover you. situation up top. They are on full map, melting the building down. We'll have to fight our way out. We're gonna need some heavier gear. I know just the place, my friend. Oh! There are heavy weapons by the elevator when they brought me down. Southwest courtyard in five minutes. Belikov is hitching a ride. Plenty of room in the backseat. Once we get off the elevator, just keep moving towards the courtyard. Get the charge ready, though. Let's go, Bell. for your call. They caused a hell of a mess in Moscow. Was it worth it? Adler managed to get the list of sleeper agent names, despite himself. He's got balls, I'll give him that. Bell did well. Seemingly. But I think that team is getting too comfortable. They're acting like they know who they're dealing with. Perhaps. Turns out, one of those sleeper agents is tied to Operation Greenlight. Theodore Hastings. He's a nuclear engineer based out of Salt Lake City. And you believe Hastings is the one he'll activate? Exactly. Total surveillance is already underway. It's only a matter of time before he leads us straight to Perseus. This is it. The recent movements of Theodore Hastings has led us here. Cuba. Right in our backyard. A vacant government facility in the Cuban countryside has become a hub of activity for Perseus, and the likely location of the stolen nuke. No doubt Castro allowed it. Twenty bucks to anyone who could bring him down before me. Who? Castro or Perseus? Whoever. We are not gonna let him move this nuke inside the States. It's time to take down Perseus once and for all. Team, wrap up any unfinished business. Once we strike, there's no turning back. Whoa. 
woods. Don't get any bright ideas over there. Yeah, <laughs> you've got my sure as shit guarantee, Hudson. I think we'll end it right there. It's been a long mission. I was thinking of doing more than one, but this has been a huge mission. I think I'll do the remaining two side missions in the next video. Because after this, like Hudson said, there's no turning back. Probably. So, yeah, we'll do that and then get on with what's probably the final mission. Anyway, thank you for your support along the series so far. It's been a beautiful game and your support too was overwhelming. Do subscribe to see the remaining parts. If you haven't seen the rest, it will be in the description below. Do like and comment down what you think of the video. Thank you for watching again. See you in the next one.